we've seen lots of studies about, um, or lots of articles about how Facebook makes us unhappy or how social oh. media does. So <laughs> what is kind of the, the long-term impact of that, of that extra comparison? Now you're not just looking at celebrities and how you look, you're looking at your, your friends or your friend's friends and, and how does that affect a developing teenager? Yeah, so there's been a couple studies done where girls are much more likely to do what's called downward social comparisons where they'll really fixate on um, their friends who look really pretty in their profile picture or who look like they're having so much fun or have so many likes or so many friends and really feel worse about themselves versus focusing on um, the other you know, hundred friends that you have that maybe don't look so great in their profile picture, or don't have that many friends. Um, so it is something that if you already kind of have a tendency to be insecure, which a lot of, of adolescent girls do for a variety of reasons, it does sort of add that potential reminder, particularly if you're checking it all day long, that, you know, I'm not good enough. Look at how pretty she is. I'm not good enough. So it's important to to remind girls not to compare themselves to their friends or to, to strangers online and, and, and think of ways in which you can really interact with them so that they understand that.